Hi Libra, all right, let's see what's going on for you. We're going to use this deck and see what is going on for Libra. Unexpected heartbreak, feeling sad, looking at your picture. Someone is thinking about you, missing you. I feel like it was their choice though not to be with you or something or to move. I kind of feel like this is deserved. I just kind of get they're surprised, but it's deserved because they they were the one who decided to break up or to move on or not to be with you or something like that. This is unexpected. Could be an earth sign. I guess somebody went somewhere and it reminded them of you. Somebody um it could have been a message, could have been they went to a party, a museum. Uh, I'm getting a lot of different things, but something triggered them recently. It was something out. I don't get it was a message. I get it was uh, some, something that was said or somewhere they went and somebody said something. They could also be somewhere that the two of you used to go. And like, I feel like a third wheel with this three of coins. Someone's a third wheel. So unexpected invitation going somewhere and then not being with you this could be i see a king of cups with the two of cups right now so hmm okay could also be a leo an earth sign or a leo that's feeling this way so i'm getting the name james jamerson someone may i think that's also maybe a whiskey some may be drinking whiskey right now okay someone feels like they can't let go that there's still possibilities here so, and they could be kind of delusional though. Somebody, is this the same person? Someone just can't let go. They feel like there's possibilities. Wanting to bring this back, reminiscing, thinking. Yeah, star card is hoping, possibilities, but their judgment's not super clear. Could be an Aquarius or a Gemini here. I got Leo, wow. They, well, it's funny because the sun is like very clear seeing. Maybe they're realizing that they had bad judgment in the past, that they can make this work. Maybe they feel like they can work this out now. It's so funny because the feeling I'm getting is that they were the one to dismiss the connection or let it go. And now they're realizing, hey, maybe we can make this work. Maybe this is like a long distance thing. Um, so I, I don't know, I'm getting like Africa or South Africa for somebody, for some reason, I don't know why that's coming through. But I don't know if what they're doing at the moment, but it just feels kind of like they're really second guessing everything they did. Yeah, maybe they want to have a family with you now. They could be with their own family or they could be in another connection with the Ten of Cups. But I'm feeling like, I almost feel like this person could come up with some crazy ideas that are a little out of the blue, a little out of left field, Libra. And you're kind of like, is this kind of like random? But they're all of a sudden feeling very, very nostalgic or something. They say they love you. The energy in their reading with the tarot is beautiful. It's like they went somewhere, they either saw something, heard something, talked to someone, and it triggered them. And it's all of a sudden made them think about you in the past. And that there could still be possibilities between the two of you. And they realize that they just weren't seeing things clearly. Um, that they want to be with you. They love you. I'm getting a name like George or Joe or something like that, that name. Also getting like an A name like Antoine or Anthony or Nicholas, Nico, something like that. Okay. What truth? They see something clearly now. They want to speak their truth. Wow. They're passionate. They're passionate about a new beginning with you. They want to speak their truth. They're passionate. Under the deck is the four of cups, but they don't know how you're feeling, Libra. Because I feel like you're a little bit more sensible. I don't know. Something tells me like they broke up with you, but you got over it or you see it as like that is okay that you moved on. And now the way they're coming back around, you're feeling kind of like, well, I don't know if this could work now that, you know, we've been through so much or you've been through so much healing. Yeah, because see, you walked away, you let it go. I think this kind of haunted you for a while. Now it's gonna haunt them. So something that haunted you haunts them. And yeah, they think about it a lot at night. They're having possibly even bad dreams with that combination there. Okay, 
It could be a Capricorn, but it's interesting. Okay. Oh, the runner. Okay, that came out in the the uh, collective I did. Someone running from feelings. So maybe in the past they were running from feelings. They didn't want to develop feelings. They didn't want to take it any further. Now they're realizing like how foolish that was. That was really stupid. So and they're getting anxious. Yeah, they're they're they could be stressed, depressed, having panic attacks, or just feeling restless because they miss you so much. That came out. Those two I know came out in the other reading I did. So. I don't know if this person also has anything to do with like religion or Christianity. I think that came up overwhelmed, feeling overwhelmed by something. I don't know. I'm getting like a specific energy off this person. Somebody who almost like a doctor or someone who like really like follows the rules or I shouldn't say it that way. They feel like they had to follow the rules and do things very specifically, you know, go to school, get that degree, get that um, uh, career. And it's like they may not feel fulfilled anymore by it. Why are they so anxious? Because they ran? Or why are they feeling anxious, Libra? Because they may know that they missed a really good opportunity to possibly be married. And now it's bothering them. The strength card. What are they going to do? Tell me what they're going to do. They could travel to come see you, drive to come see you, the chariot. And then what are they going to say or how are you going to feel when they tell you this? What are you going to feel? Justice. Justify. Wow. So it's kind of like someone saying, I see it your way, Libra, now. I realize, you know, I messed up. I did something wrong. And you're going to be like, yeah, I told you. But how are you going to respond after that? You're good, the Nine of Pentacles. Well, you probably are, Libra. You probably did fine. After you healed and moved on, you probably are good. And that's how they also view the Nine of Pentacles. This person could be emotional. The King of Cups is under the deck. So what do you want us to know? Passion flipped around, but I'm going to put it back. The passion was in reverse. I don't think these have reverse meaning, but maybe you don't have passion for them anymore. Oh, well, maybe you do. Chemistry came out now. Kind of the same thing to me. Chemistry, passion. This could be a very strong counterpart connection. You can call it whatever you like, as I always say. An apology. Chemistry, twin flame, and wanting to apologize. Mm. Well, like, this, like they say, the ball's in your court, and you can do what you want or not do. What are they feeling right now? What are they feeling right now? They want to move fast. This may be the person I picked up on last week. If they haven't made any sort of move, this could be the same one. Because that came out last week. Somebody wanted to move quickly. Um, I got two more. So I got, they're vibing and need space. Okay, I think this happened before. The, I think the two of you were getting along really well. And then they just, poof, needed space. They said they needed to run. They need to be free. So your person is a runner. Do you see them running against spirit? person kind of like runs on high high adrenaline or maybe they drink too much coffee or maybe they they don't seem like a person who make bad choices i think they make good choices in like work and school and things like that but when love they don't make good choices they don't know how to handle it are they going to run again you see them running two of wands making a new decision knight of coins they may not because both of those are you know well obviously the knight of coins is a slow energy so he's not running he's standing an offer. What else do you see with this? The Tower and the Knight of Cups. So they could come in very differently instead of coming in with coins and the money and what they've done, come in with love, come in with, um, you know, an offer of love. So this is good. This is a change. Again, you may not want, you know, a coin. You may be like, because you came with Nine of Coins. You may like, I want something romantic, loving. What does this person want to say to you, Libra? I regret what I did to you. Did we start with regret? I don't remember. But okay, I let's see. I'm sorry I hurt you. I didn't realize what I had until it was gone. I underestimated how important you are in my life. I know we have a soul connection and one more. I want to make you happy. I miss your smile. I realize all the mistakes I've made. Yeah, well. How is Libra going to feel? How are you going to feel, Libra, about this person? You're going to give them another chance. What is Libra going to feel? The seven of coins. You're going to look at the past. This could be you or an air sign like you. Hmm. 
Libra. You might just give this a chance. I think this person's gonna sweet talk you. Um, the Seven of Wands, I always read this as like a blocking card, but it, but this string, it's not. This is, you, know, you may play a little hard to get, or you may just kind of like turn your head a little bit and they're gonna have to say the right thing. I guess someone's ticklish. I don't know if they tickle you or you're ticklish or something, or they're going to like, yeah, they're gonna manifest you. They're gonna try to manifest you being happy, they want to make you happy. They're going to say or do something to make you happy. They're going to take you out. You got a lot of cup cards here. It's like this person's grown up. They've changed um, quite a bit. They may want to get married. Getting the name Carl. Also, I'm getting that Carl Jr. for some reason. Maybe someone's eating that. I'm sorry food is coming through. I'm not hungry. I don't know if that's the first thing that's come through. But um, there is love here. Maybe that was their favorite place to go or something. They want to study. They want to work on this connection. Okay, well, we've got that going. So I'm going to leave that there for now. I want to see what other messages here are coming in for you, Libra, because I feel like there's another opportunity. Well, it says benefactor, grace and generosity. I do feel like this person is generous. I don't know if they were in the past. I do feel like there's like this kindness about them now that wasn't there before. I feel like they're very compassionate. I feel like they have empathy. Um, they maybe they lack that before, but they have it now. Um, Christopher, what else is going on for um, Libra? Stepping into a new experience. For somebody, this could be like, be, you know, a new role, a new dynamic in the relationship. You could be getting married, or you know, becoming a um, partner or something like that with this person. Vol says, don't back down from opposition, show strength and fortitude. That somebody thinks highly of you. It says you're highly thought of. I do feel that with this person. And you could be receiving a gift. And it is a diamond. This always reminds me of like a ring or something. So it's interesting. All right. First, it might be a Taurus. Uh, some of you may be Taurus or Taurus rising or moon or something also. I'm kind of getting there. Okay, Libra, Libra. Fork in the road, but it is in reverse. A deep knowing, you may not need to make a decision that right now, this person is just what you want, milk and honey. I haven't seen that reading in a while, or sorry, this card in a while. Mine's in the 10 of cups. So this in reverse is like, you don't need to make a decision. You already know. This person shows up and you're on board with it. You're going to go for it. You like this person. They're a great catch. Um, if they propose, if they want to move this forward, you're going to say yes, because you know that there's a lot waiting for you with this person. Financially, emotionally, I think it's just a good connection. So I do see you possibly mending something. So I'm going to leave it there, Libra. Have a great week.